Alrighty, guys. Welcome back to more WWE 2K24 My Rise. Hope you guys are ready for some more. We got Gabriel Slade up on deck. Hey, hope I didn't throw off your flow out there. I was just pulling for you, and I couldn't help myself. What is your angle, Gabriel? <laughs> you called me Gabriel. Man, I don't have an angle. I'm just a fan and an all-around good guy, remember? I'm trying to help you hold on to your title. So you can take it off me? You made it clear that you didn't want to face me, and I respect that. Everyone should get to make their own choices about what they want to do with their title. Like it was so unfair that time Shawn Michaels and Randy Orton took the title away from Slade. Anyway... So you weren't trying to send a message with that run-in? Just the message that I want to see you succeed. And I plan on doing whatever I can to make that happen. Sign me up as the newest member of the Horse Force. Wherever you what? go, whatever you do, I'll be right there supporting you. Sounds like either I need to get a restraining order or give you a title match. Really? Wow. That came out of nowhere. Sure it did. But listen, don't be upset when you find out you're not the only one who can play games. Now I really can't wait for this match. Neither can I. Then I can finally get rid of you. Once and for all. Gabriel Slade. Jesus fuck. I thought he was in the past with Jason Briggs. Three it's title cool. matches in three weeks. I need to speak to Miz. I've sports entertained enough. All right, that's it. Come on. Galloping into history, defying all odds. It's the Dark Horse. Oh, oh, I just realized I'm wearing the locks gear. Just fucking realized that. Introducing no, I'm on this guy dead, damn it. It's deja vu once again. The WWE Universal Champion defends his title against Gabriel Slade, who has reemerged from the shadows, going from overlooked to overachiever in the blink of an eye. The champ's playing some mind games with the challenger, coming in dressed as his former ally turned rival turned elusive opponent, The Lock. Gabe's got to stay focused. A win puts him back on the map. Another loss, and people are going to remember why they forgot him in the first place. Ah, shit! Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Goodness, inverted suplex. Battling ringside, and our announce Whoa. table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. Well, I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. Ah, uh, Fujiwara. Byron, I'm going to punch you. Polarizing <laughs> the arm is a great way to create an advantage, basically forcing your opponent to fight one-handed. Gut-wrench suplex. Clearly an attack that very few superstars can perform with such ease. Toss back into the ring. Over the top rope in followed by the Lariat. Oh, kick right to the Jesus shit. Big forearm. Big blow could be felt throughout the arena. Oh, nothing fancy with that boot. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. And Slade is being controlled here. Slade has to devise a new plan here. Over the top rope into a lariat. <laughs> Superman punch. Could Fine, be here seconds we go. away from seeing Slade fall. 
What? Gabriel? Not Gabriel. You don't want to do this. You don't want to do this. Armbar. Oh, Fujiwara armbar applied with the championship on the line. He breaks the pin before a one count. How on earth could he not keep him down for even one at this point? Over the top rope, Flinchot Lariat, the champion in It's over. Cover. Oh shit, it is. Here is your winner, and Steve! Just give me my title and let me leave this man. Dual duel. Ninety. Apparently, I've having sports entertained in the uh, final. Do the King of the Ring. I'm in. Fine. I know I'm gonna have to defend my belt throughout the whole tournament. I have to face. Oh, we probably don't talk about him anymore. Ah, oh, boy. Bold move entering the King of the Ring champ. If you think that Drew Gulak of all people deserves a shot, you're 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 actually insane. As much as I'd love to spend some time pulling out my fingernails in a conversation with you, I gotta go get ready for Drew Gulak. Oh, I definitely wouldn't want to cramp the champ with a bunch of small talk. Just thought you'd want to know that the Miz has made this tournament even more. Must. And what does that mean exactly? It means that Miz has made your matches in the tournament a little more interesting. What do we I got? Have matches. Tie one hand behind my back. Iron Man. Dominic on a pole match. Ah. Huh? Uh, before your time. Just lay it on me, Troy. In every one of your tournament matches, the WWE Universal title will be on the line. Seriously? You didn't see this coming? Does this seem like the kind of thing a WWE producer would joke about? Just think about it. This has never They're been done producer. before. It truly is. Must see. I'm just waiting for the ability to throw Troy Simkin through a fucking wall. Go ahead and tell your boss that my knees got to shaking and tears welled in my eyes because of his devastating curveball. Hi. <laughs> Wait, what? Not the reaction you were expecting. All this does is make it that much sweeter when I beat Drew Gulak and anyone else you put in my path. Now that will be must-see. Gulak loses. He, he, he just, no, no world does he win the title. No world. Zero. Zip. Zip nada. I'm going to be King of the Ring and Universal Champion all at once. The following contest is a king of the ring. Hope well, we don't get to watch you. 
And there he is, the man who's blazing his trail. Let's kill him. The fact that... All right, you guys ready to kill him? Any sort of tournament is as much a mental challenge as it is a physical one. But our WWE Universal Champion will have the added pressure of defending his title at every turn. It's hard to believe that he would agree to something like this unless there was some coercion involved. Miz was involved, so it's likely coercion was too. Whatever the reason, the dark horse. Am I really losing the black? If he wants to remain WWE Universal Champion, slips out of the way there. What reflexes? Scissors kick with authority. Over the top rope is followed by a lariat. Scissors kick, sucker. I'm sorry, who do you think uh, you are? Buries a knee to the body. You think that I, this is going to be a walk in the park for you, Gulak? Fire stops to the back. And Drew Gulak isn't being given any room to recover. With no doubt, this is a tough spot for Drew Gulak. Sent into the corner. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. And that definitely made solid impact. No, what do you From think you're doing? Backbreaker delivered. And a ripcord lariat follows. Boom! Scissors catch, sucker! He'll head to the ring. Whoa. Sorry, who do you think you are, Gulak? Ooh, clothesline delivered. Over the top rope. Once again. Here's the pin. Title on the line. Doesn't even get a signature. And that title still okay. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Oh, ow. Looks like he's got 11 arms and feet. And Drew Gulak isn't being given any room to recover. With no doubt this is a tough spot for Drew Gulak. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Air raid. Oh, haven't seen this in a long time. The old air raid siren. And the champion finally ready to put this it's one over. Away. And the champ retains. Here is your winner. And still. The that was Drew Gulak you put me against. Gulak. Impressive tournament win slash title defense. You must be very proud of yourself. Yeah, you put me against Gulak. I respond with insult. You make snarky remark. I reply with a reference you don't understand. You are totally confused, but play along. And then finally get to the point. That about cover how this usually goes? I mean, <laughs> I guess. In wrestling, we call that a cutoff. Say your thing. Your opponent for next week's King of the Ring second round, he'll be unable to compete. Fortunately... Drew McIntyre is available. So, I'm um, only fighting guys named Drew? What? Oh, th that's not the point. The point is that McIntyre is only available tonight. So in our main event, I'll compete for the second time against fresh Drew number two. The title will be on the line, and Miz has champagne on ice for if I lose. Y yes. It's gonna be a dry celebration, Troy. Anything else you want me to tell you you're gonna say? No. Good. At some point, you'll realize you backed the wrong horse in Miz. <laughs> Boy, I should just throw him through a window. Oh my god, McIntyre. We beat your ass already once at SummerSlam. At least you're going to be more of a challenge than Gulak. The following contest is a key. Come on, no entity. I'm tired of the shit.
Introducing the challenger from Ayers. I am defending my belt every fucking week. Ever. Well, scrambling to figure out what's going on as the champ takes on his second opponent of the night. And not the opponent he's expecting. It seems the path to royal glory is filled with thrilling surprises. I can't say I respect the Miz as a GM or a human being, but I do respect the guts it takes to lean so heavily on ah. the scales to do this. The audacity is impressive. We'll see if the Dark Horse can match that audacity with tenacity to try to defeat Drew McIntyre. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Oh, clothesline. Boom. The champ not in a great place. Drew making clear he came for a fight and he's not satisfied yet. The battle prop. Oh, he gets what he deserves for all that gloating. Comes back into the ring. Luthes yeah. press, raining down right hands. That was a furious assault from the champion. Each blow coming in harder than the last. Over the top rope into a lariat. Oh. Adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is oh, yeah. on his side. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. McIntyre is getting dismantled. Drew's getting cut off at the knees at Fair. every turn. Raining down right hands. Practically never-ending blows coming at full force here. He's positioned up on that turnbuckle. Come here. Oh, just dropped. Trying to find his Get bearings, up. but it looks like his end is near. Over the top rope is followed by the Lariat for the title. Come here. Kick out for the challenger. Close call, but not enough yet. Full Nelson a point. Yeah. Into a sit out face buster. I think the champ's got it. Two. Oh and shit, it's over. Stands tall once again. Here is your winner. And stand. The undisputed. Boy, Miz. Yeah. You don't have any champagne, right? Troy. Champ! You're going to face Otis in the finals tonight. Otis? I like Otis. Nice, <laughs> Troy. Succinct, to the point. Minimum attitude. One of these days, you'll be a real boy. That's one of those references, isn't it? Ah, life is full of mystery. Otis, huh? No shocking twist? You think Miz and I are so predictable? Well, yeah. Fine. Otis will be your opponent in the King of the Ring finals. Along with Chad Gable in a two-on-one handicap match with the undisputed WWE Universal title on the line. Got it. After I win, does Miz crown me himself, or does he send his stooge? Who's Miz's stooge? Oh, you mean me. Yeah. When this is all said and done, I expect a full bow before your new king. Yeah. Here we go. All on SmackDown. By the way, might want to point that out. Oh, this came in the ring tournament show. Um, hey, Michael, you, can you please? <laughs> you know, I've had a lot of embarrassing things happen to me in my career. That may have been the most embarrassing thing ever, Saxton. The Pops will determine the king of the ring. Kings of the 
the ring. what might be his toughest test. A two-on-one handicap match for his title in the King of the Ring tournament crown. Will it be a coronation or frustration? If the Dark Horse does fall in this one after coming so close, the frustration will be off the charts. But with it, he just might silence any remaining critics who say his title isn't earned. The King of the Ring tournament and a load of respect is on the line. You might say it's go throne or go home. Ah. You might not. But oh, right down. Line. It's cinched in. This could be over. After everything, these two men. We're going to free the arm and does just that. Oh, look at these kicks. Oh. Wow. I think rage took over in that moment. Nothing but blind rage. Out. Otis, if you would please. Cord Lariat. Drop kick. Hits the mark. Big kick. Vicious, aggressive attacks. And Gable there got a little wrestling 101 of his own. Placed into the corner. A crisscross action. And what a roll the elbow. Was mounted with punches. And not bleeding a nasty stop to finish it off can if he can piss off so me and gable can have a gable little wrestle to gather the energy to turn the tables gable might be waking up gable tipping the scales a bit here well executed suplex and into the count great officiating as the ref noticed he was on the ropes ah. counters this could be an opportunity <laughs> Connects to the back of the neck. Yes, tag. Otis was just a step slow. Yeah. Oh, I haven't seen this in a long time. The old air raid crash. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Big kick out. Wow. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Scissors kick with authority. Over the top rope into a lariat. There we are. Go tag out to Gable, please. And tag. He did it. Let's go. Miss timing with that springboard. Wait. German. Just pure dominance. Oh, he's looking to completely render this leg no. useless. Stop Damn it. Puller leg snap. Very effective. No, let go of my legs. Uh oh. Great display of power in the tip lift German suplex. Well, they say everyone has a plan until they get punched in the mouth. Well, someone just threw their plan out the window. Tables. Got the full Nelson locked in. Marcel, full Nelson face buster. Crap. Will the rain continue? And there's the same. Damn you, Otis. Both wrists captured. And that was nasty. For the win. Two. The odds were stacked against the I got him with the knee. 
Universal Champion, and he overcame. This is an insult to the crown, Cole. An insult, Ow. Corey? The Miz forced the champ to defend his title in every match of this tournament. You need to put some respect on his name. All hail King Dark Horse. Hail this King AJ Elliott. I will never respect that man, whether he's wearing a crown or not. The new King just defeated two opponents to win the tournament, which has never been done before. That gets respect in my book. Exactly, Corey. You don't know shit. You don't know shit, Corey Graves. You don't know what I went through. I'm the fucking king, damn it. I expect Miz to bow at my feet. <laughs> yes, you can't do shit about it. Oh, man. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe for more, tap the notification bell so you never miss an upload, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.